Anthony Belia, president of Belia Workspace Professionals and partner in Belia, in Belia Digital Print Cotton. So two companies. Consistent revenue. Yeah, yeah. It, avoiding that spike, that sales spike. We need to look far enough ahead in that sales funnel. Stop concentrating on the 90 day and pay more attention to projects that are a year out, two years out. Yeah, uh, so that we avoid that constant. That, that's the that's the secret. Originally, that was a tough question to answer because I'm a customer of BDU. But so I, I, I was a little hesitant on what I was gonna what I was gonna get from today. But one of the things I realized quite quickly was that some of my sales management skills uh, we definitely can do more in implementing uh, more sales process, uh, sales management, uh, the reporting piece of it. That, to me, I realize uh, as I was sitting in that meeting, I'm going, oh, I've got a lot of work to do. Uh, that, to me, I know that when I get on the phone with Heather on Tuesday, that's one of the things that I'm going to, I'm going to talk about. Uh, I, I think the LinkedIn, uh, reinforcing that, you know, reinforcing the things that I've already learned through Brim, um, just understanding more and more about how LinkedIn is so powerful. Uh, that, to me, I know that I, I can certainly utilize and I can share with the people with the organization. Particularly with the salespeople, I need to make sure that my salespeople are doing exactly the same thing that I'm doing with LinkedIn because we all have to have the same exact message. So that, that is why. Uh, I can tell you what doesn't surprise me the most, and that would be Lisa Peskin's uh, energy. That's, that's uh, but what surprised me the most, I, I think Larry Dillon uh, surprised me the most. I uh, wasn't expecting him to present the way he did with the topics that he had. Uh, I was hoping he'd get into a little more detail, but uh, based upon the amount of time that we had, uh, I certainly enjoyed his presentation uh, as much as possible. I think some of the uh, search engine optimization and talking about the SEO and how it relates to you know making sure that, that what you're doing on B2B scale, uh, that the SEO is, is equally as important. Um, that's me I would want to talk about. That, that's the piece of it that I think as you're doing lead generation, if you don't have your, your, your search engine optimization on point with the rest of the marketing efforts, you really just fall apart. That's me, really stuck in